What's up, y'all? Welcome back in the shop. We got a little project on the agenda here tonight, and uh, it's about Christmas time, and uh, I'm gonna be making a little, I guess you'd call it like a sensory toy uh, for my little boy. <laughs> you see the steam from my mouth, or uh, fog. It's a little bit chilly out here tonight. But uh, anyway, we're gonna be putting this together, and uh, I came up with this idea, because the other day, uh, nothing to do, and I had this random bolt with a nut on it, and uh, I give it to him to play with, and he had a blast just screwing the nut on and off and just playing with that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a piece of box beam and some nuts and bolts and a couple wrenches and screwdrivers, and I basically make a compartment to hold them in, uh, weld the nuts to it, and uh, he can practice and get familiar with the different sizes of bolts and how to screw them in and out and all that. And he's pretty good with it already, but it'll give him a good reference and something to play with, so. We'll get right into it. I'll show you the materials I got here and we'll see what we can make. All right, this is what we're working with. Uh, so these two little screwdrivers, Phillips and uh, Flathead, and then the crescent wrench are gonna be what's included with the toy. You give them something to play with on that. And I'm basically gonna make a closed end on one end of this beam. The other end's gonna have a little door that hinges open and closed. It's got this little bolt welded on it with a wing nut on it. Unscrew the wing nut, open the door pull the tools out uh these different sizes of bolts here i got six different sizes goes from a quarter inch all the way up to five eighths all the sizes got quarter five sixteenths three eighths seven sixteenths half and then five eighths and those nuts are going to all get welded on here the magnetic tray is going to get bolted on the end of here you can keep the bolts so they don't don't get lost they'll sit in the magnetic tray he can screw them in and out uh, practice with his wrenches and these two smaller ones flathead and phillips and that'll where, where the screwdrivers come in but uh, that's what we're gonna make and uh, see how this goes i think it'll be a little fun thing for him to play with he's uh pretty mechanically minded and likes things that rotate and tools and all that stuff he's gonna have a blast with it so let's see what we can do all right so the first thing we're gonna do is just cut this to length i already put a mark on it and I had to drill out this hole to five eighths, this hole to half inch. Already got that done. The rest of these holes are seven sixteenths and smaller, so we don't need to drill those. Just gonna cut this out. And I don't have a table to work on because I haven't built one yet. I need to get that done, but whatever. We'll work on the floor we're used to. galvanized so we're gonna have to grind off a little bit make sure these welds will stick and it's gonna all have to be cleaned up and buffed off and polished up real nice so he doesn't get hurt on it but, but uh, he is a mechanics boy too so he's used to being around stuff like this these on here. Doesn't have to be anything overkill at all.
I haven't decided what kind of finish I'm going to put on this. I think I might actually clear coat it. Either that or paint it black and maybe paint bolts orange or something. <clears throat> pieces for the door and the end cap and then uh, we'll get you back on and you'll be able to see. Alright, so I got the end all on here. Got it ground pretty smooth. I'll finish it off at a scotch like this. I got this made. I don't know if you can see this plate of metal I brought in from outside. But got this made which is going to be the door. And that's where this is going to go in. And uh, we're going to attack the hinge on here right now. turned out pretty nice. All right, let's cut this bolt head off. Now we just got to drill a couple holes through here. This is a, yeah, there's a hole in each magnet. We're going to bolt this to the end. And yeah, let's get that down here. Uh, these bolts are too long. Let's see if we got shorter ones.
course, this is covered in shavings now. Clean that up. Most of this stuff I have laying around except for these little bolts that I had to buy from Home Depot. We'll see if uh, he gets his unscrewing these bolts and taking the magnet off. He probably will. Alright, there's the gist of it. We're going to get it all cleaned up and polished up and I won't bore you all with that. But also, I'll tell you when I get it all cleaned up. The tools go in there. Close it up. Put the clean that on. And all the bolts through in the holes. And yeah. We'll get it all cleaned up. Here it is, I got it all cleaned up. Uh, I just polished the whole thing with a scotch bright disc and uh, I ended up painting it because I didn't think the galvanized, the different colored uh, nuts and the welds and everything were gonna match very well with the clear coat or just leave it raw metal. And I didn't want it to start surface rusting, condensation, moisture. I mean, it's bound to happen even if it's in the house. So I ended up just painting it black. I left the silver, silver, I like the black and the silver accents but uh turned out pretty nice i ended up putting cork pads they're just a uh, peel and stick so it doesn't scratch the floor because it is going to be in the house and uh, i upgraded my tools i got in here a little bit got a craftsman phillips and straight or phillips and flathead and a uh, fuller crescent wrench so yeah, it turned out pretty nice. I'm pretty happy with it. And I'm sure my boy will have a blast with it. Might be only a gift for a boy. But uh, I'm sure there's some little girls out there would have a blast with something like this too. But this is my version of a sensory Christmas present for my boy. So I'm sure he'll love it. Appreciate you watching. Hope you enjoyed what I built here and maybe to give you some inspiration and ideas down the road for something you might want to make for one of your kids or anything at all so uh, appreciate you watching stay tuned till next time